I think that, um, you know, we, what we're trying to do is build that culture and uh, continue to, you know, try to recruit at a high level. Um, have an opportunity to sign uh, Blake Harris, who's a top 100 kid, a four star uh, coming out of high school. It just shows you uh, where we're trying to take this program. Uh, you know, with Quay, Quay Parker being here, with Tyler May, uh, all three of those guys had opportunities to play at a high level. And um, we're going to try to continue to bring those type of kids to campus and see uh, what we have to offer. Because it's not just a basketball program. Uh, you know, North Carolina a t has a lot to offer uh, young men. And so, um, you know, you get them on campus and they're very excited. And uh, hopefully we continue to win and, and try to continue to recruit at that level. How are you selling? How are you selling the program, uh, or the you know, or the school in, in general? How are you selling that when you go to a kid like Blake, who's gone to an ACC school and things like that, or a Quay who went to SEC straight out of high school? How are you selling the program to them, and and are they already coming in with some knowledge of of what she, of what the school at least has to offer? Um, what what, re what really happens is, uh, you know, we've been really good with transfers. Uh, you know, Femi uh, Oladuvi. I mean. That was five points a game at Oakland. Um, we came here, and probably was pound for pound the best player in HBCU basketball. Hurt to lose him, but that the facts are the facts. Um, and what really happens is I tell them on the phone, or we tell them on the phone that we got you know twelve to thirteen thousand students on campus. You know uh, the games are very fun, um, and then they get here and they see all the buildings and uh, the students and, and the Aggie pride that it's real. And then, you know, we continue to recruit them and ask them to give us a chance. And um, when they've given us a chance, they've been successful. And so uh, we've graduated 100% of the guys that we've signed here. And so we just want to continue to, to do that. Yeah, and you know, you come from, you play for, uh, play for coach over at South Carolina State. Um, you guys wanted me after you were there. Um, so you know what it's like to win and, and what it takes to win. Um, your, your team hasn't experienced that quite yet. You got to the final four of the MEAC last, uh, last year. What is it, uh, how far are you guys away from it? And what is it going, have you instilled in them that, that drive to get there to that next step? The next step is what we really, what we really talked about all off season. Uh, we've won a lot of games the last two years in conference and we haven't been able to finish the job. And so um, I think this team is grit is grittier than the last two teams. The last two teams could really, one of them are really good offensively. One was really good defensively. I think this team is a combination of both. We athletic, we got some, some youth, we got some older guys, we got some grit. And so we're gonna to try to continue to win games um, in the league, but we're gonna focus on being able to be that gritty team that's gonna get that rebound in that last, you know, in, that, in the MEAC tournament that's gonna to help us propel to maybe the, hopefully the championship game.